So hello everyone. Uh, welcome you all to this new video where we are continuing with the model paper solutions of the first subject of fifth sem EC, technological innovation and uh, management entrepreneurship. So I have already covered with module one solutions. You can check it out in the uh, previous video. It is available. So now in this video, I'm going to continue with module two, model paper solutions of this subject. So within a few days, we are having this exam. So please like, share, subscribe to the channel and spread these uh, videos to a huge number. So that model paper, uh, by referring the model paper, uh, it will be easy for you to learn. Okay. So without wasting much time, let us continue with the next question. Okay. That is 3A of module two. What is an organization? Explain the principles of organization. Okay. Organizing is the process of arranging resources, tasks and activities systematically to achieve organizational goals efficiently. It involves defining roles, responsibilities and relationships within the organization. Okay. The principles of organizing are unity of objectives. Uh, all organizational activities should align within, uh, within the overall objectives. The objectives should be in unity. That's the, that is the, we should be, we should not be having any difference of opinion between the objectives, between the teammates. Okay. Next is division of work. Tasks should be divided into smaller and manageable activities based on specialization and skill. This enhances efficiency and productivity. Okay. Its role is it increases efficiency a bit within the team members. Next, we have authority and responsibility, span of control, coordination, flexibility, delegation, and these are the main points. You can note it down. Okay. Any five to six points, if you note down, it's enough. So let's get to the next question now. Define recruitment and explain the steps involved in the recruitment process. Okay. This is very important question. I have also given this question in my uh, important set of questions video. You can check it out that as well. Okay. Recruitment and selection process. Uh, recruitment is the process of identifying potential candidates and uh, encouraging them to apply for job openings. It acts as a bridge between job seekers and employers by creating a pool of qualified applicants. Okay. That is the uh, first is by identifying job vacancies. Organizations determine their manpower, needs and identity of vacant positions that require filling. For example, a software company identifies the need of five additional developers for a new project. Next is sourcing candidates, encouraging applications, etc. Next is selection. Selection is a process of evaluating applicants to identify and hire the most suitable candidates for the job. That is, it ensures that the only qualified individuals are employed. Okay, so there are some of the steps in the selection process. If you pass that, you the selection process would be complete. Okay, first we should be having the receipt of applications. Then after that, screening of applications, employment tests, interviews, background investigation, medical examination, all of them, and final selection. Okay, so this is the basic flow chart which involves uh, the step selection process. Okay, and with, with this explanation, I've tried to explain you all. Receipt of applications, that is uh, organizations collect applications through online portals, emails or other methods. Okay, next is screening of applications. The reviewing, uh, reviewing of applications uh, of resumes, whether it is valid or invalid. For that, uh, we should be doing the screening of applications. Next is employment tests. Candidates undergo tests to assess their skills, knowledge or personality traits, which is relevant to the job. Next, we have interviews. Shortlisted people are uh, have uh, have to face the on, uh, offline or online interviews to assess their suitability for the role. This may include technical HR or panel interviews. Okay, for example, a project manager candidate is interviewed to evaluate leadership and problem solving skills. Next, we have background investigation and medical examination. Okay, the background is checked whether uh, you are medically fit to qualify for the inter after uh, for the particular job or not. For that, medical examination is also done. And then the final selection after evaluating uh, the applications, uh, interviews, tests and all the final selection is made. Okay. For example, offering a role of software developer to a candidate passed off all the selection states. Okay. So this is the answer. Please note it down. Next question. With the help of a diagram, explain Maslow's need of hierarchy theory with example. Okay. Then first is Maslow's theory of motivation. Okay. It's the uh, Maslow's uh, main need is of motivation. He thought to motivate people and he provide some of the uh, theories of, for that. That is, uh, it, he proposed a hierarchy of needs to explain human motivation. According to him, individuals are motivated 
to satisfy needs in a sequential manner from basic to advanced okay first is psychological needs uh, that is basic survival needs such as food shelter water air etc safety needs security and stability job security etc next is social needs then we then we have the esteem needs of recognition respect and self worth self actualization that is fulfilling one's potential and pursuing the personal growth okay growing uh, within in uh, growing within inside and you should be uh, self uh, confident about yourself okay so these are the five points and this is the maslow's flow chart okay you can uh, note it down it uh, the higher level uh, con uh, con uh, the in the top most we have self actualization morality creativity spontaneity problem solving all of them comes under this next we have esteem needs self esteem confidence achievement respect of others respect by others love and belonging friendship family sexual intimacy etc safety security of body employment of resources morality of the family health property etc psychological needs comes at the end that is breathing food water sex sleep uh, excretion etc okay this is the flow uh, basic chart of maslow's theory please note it down very important so next question define controlling explain the essentials of an effective control system okay so controlling is the process of checking and evaluating current performance against predetermined standards outlined in the plans it ensures that organizational activities are progressing as intended and corrective action actions are taken when necessary okay so this these are the essentials of an active, effective control system uh, reveal exceptions of strategic at strategic points uh, the control system should identify significant deviations from plans at key points it focuses on critical areas where performance significantly impacts our organizational goals acceptable in organization members the control process must be understood and accepted by employees to ensure cooperation it should align uh, with the organization's culture and uh, work environment prescriptive and optional the control system should suggest uh, specific actions uh, to address deviations it must provide operational guidelines for corrective measures next is economical it uh, effective control system should be cost efficient ensuring that the benefits outweigh the cost it should avoid unnecessary complexity to save time and resources some more points we are having flexible objective and comprehensible suitable okay you can note all of them down so yeah that's all for this video guys uh, in this video i've tried to cover uh, module 2 solutions okay two questions 3a 3b 4a 4b so please go through it watch this video till the end this pdf would be available in the description that i am i will provide you in the short amount of time now it won't be available because i am working on that link now we should be converting that pdf into link form so it would be taking uh, some time so you can expect that link within this night or tomorrow morning okay so please don't uh, ask for links because uh, it is uh, difficult to provide it in an earlier time so please watch this video and take the screenshots if you want to learn uh, now itself from the video okay pause the video and uh, take the screenshots and try to learn so yeah that's all for this video guys all the best for the exams so like share subscribe to the video share this uh, channel do a huge number okay thank you